Hello freshmen, I am going to tell you how to finalize your uh, My Future Self essay and submit it to turnitin.com. The first thing you want to do is make sure that you are in Google Drive. You go to your class's My Future Self folder. Right now I am in Mr. Rosenthal and Ms. Curtin's fifth period uh, and in My Future Self. And so what I'm going to do is double click on My Essay, Mr. Rosenthal, My Future Self which is designed to be, well, not really the essay itself. In fact, it's just a bunch of repetitive words. But that's okay, because your essay should be replete with really fascinating, vivid words. Mine, instead, has a comment over here that says, not enough words, words too bland, make them vivid. Well, when I submit, I want to make sure that nothing is highlighted or underlined. Let's say this word was underlined. And uh, this word, for some reason, was highlighted. And I want to get rid of those and the comment. Well, the first thing I do is I look at the comment. Not enough words. Words too bland. Make them vivid. Let me change this one to monotonous words. Ah, what a, what a much more vivid word. And this is indeed monotonous. So now I can say resolve. And the comment goes away along with that highlighting. Thank you, Ms. Stecklin. Uh, and then I notice that we have the underlining and the highlighting. I want to get rid of that. So I'm going to select all the words. I'd say the easiest way to do that is to hold down the control button in the bottom left of your keyboard and hit A. And now I've selected all the words. I'm going to make them not underlined by first underlining them all. Whoa, that's too much. Now I hit it again. Hey, that's the right amount of no underlined words. Then I have this one that's highlighted. Let me click this A right here. Focus on highlight and hit none. And now nothing is highlighted. I have my perfect MLA heading. I have my centered title. Ah, I screwed it up, so what do I do? I undo. And then I have uh, the first paragraph, and in fact all the paragraphs, tabbed in. I am ready to submit. I've also checked it for everything. I, I've gone through my checklist to make sure that it's exactly how I want it to be. So now I go to turnitin.com, and I log in. By the way, if it says you can't log in, chances are you just forgot your password and then you should just admit that and go to reset password or forgot my password and it'll do that for you. You follow the steps that is to fix your password. So I've logged in. I'm going to go as student and I am in Ms. Brick's fourth period class for the purposes of this video. So I click on fourth period composition one, not Ms. Rachel Brick because if I click on that it's just going to email her. I don't want to do that. I want to go into the class, fourth period composition one. Here's my future self, and I've already submitted an essay just like you did in class today. So I hit resubmit, and it says a bunch of stuff that I'm going to ignore, so I just hit OK. And submission title, we'll call this Mr. Rosenthal's My Future Self. You should also name it with your full name and then My Future Self. And since I have it on Google Drive, this is very important, I click Choose from Google Drive. It'll ask me to authorize the account. Uh, you should make sure that your account is authorized. I choose this one. You'll probably just have one account. And then, hmm, it's being slow. Okay. Uh, I need to find my essay. It has to be my essay. Well, mine's right here because it's the most updated, so I can just double click it. Alternatively, you could start typing in the name of it. So I see Mr. My Future Self. I click on that. This is the right one, so I hit upload. And then after this guy thinks, ah, here is indeed the essay that I have written. My word count is 105. Yours should be closer to 1,000 or more. Uh, and I hit confirm. And then it says, congratulations, your submission is complete. This is your digital receipt. So once you get to the stage, you are done. Congratulations, you have finished your largest assignment of the year thus far. Have a good night.